Have you ever wondered? Sprint, we have a washer and a screw nut and a safety metal sheet. It did change with PX. We do have a weird, very thick washer. Look at that. And that's the reason why it is thick and has this weird shape. The security washer and also a bigger screw nut. Why was this strengthened? I don't have an advanced guess why it changed. First of all, let's have a closer look to that engine case. It's a cracked one. See the crack? And the crack is also growing out here. Thing did hit in here. Cheers! Guys, how's it going? How's life? I want to show you something today. It starts with this, with the washer and a screw nut. First, let's have a beer. Usually we do know that the washer and a screw nut is good enough. And we know the washers do have a certain strength. Maybe there's also a tooth washer below it. Hopefully a new one, not an old one like this. This is a Sprint, an old primary Christmas tree and a primary shaft. And a lot of you do know we have a security washer metal sheet. I don't know what it's called right now. Then we have the washer and then we have the screw nut. So it is exactly the same. A normal washer, maybe tooth washer, and then a screw nut. But have you ever wondered why this changed? I mean, in the end, this was good enough, wasn't it? Washer, screw nut. Washer, screw nut. We now have a look at what changed with the PX engine. I don't have an advanced guess why it changed from Sprint to the PX version. Factor number one is more power. This engine case was originally designed for 125 cubic, then 150, 180, 200. So the power got tripled. And this is my guess, also based on a tuner's tip, why this changed, why it is not just a normal screw nut and a normal washer. Because we can say this is just standard stuff. Screw nut got bigger, washer got a uh, weird strange shape first of all just have a closer look to that engine case this engine case it's a cracked one see the crack it's also cracked here all the way through and the crack is also growing out here something did hit in here and cracked the engine case that happened later it all started here when you have a closer look here what do you see? This weird shaped washer, does it touch the engine case or is that a gap? We just put a gouge in it and what we see, this washer is not touching the engine case. That's the reason why this engine case cracked. Now you see, it's just a small movement. But this is actually an anti-case cracking trick. Tuners do know it. Only few workshops know it. Even less shops do know it. Because where do you get the technical information? You go there where stuff is sold. Yes, there's not correct information at the first bullet point of the list that is profit making. Better ask an advanced tuner. So directly compare. That's PX. Before that, it was sprint, it looked like that. So, for a certain reason, and I guess a good reason, the nut got bigger, and also the washer got bigger, and it got a weird shape. And the trick is, first, you have that safety metal sheet here. Yeah, I'm gonna look it up how it's called. And then you have the washer. And the mistake all people do make is to tighten this screw nut before the clutch cover is mounted. Because what does this washer, this thick washer do when you tighten the nut? It moves. And you see that it does clamp towards the clutch cover. 
and towards the engine case. So it kind of combines these two parts additionally and it strengthens the primary shaft because the thing is a lot of force hits onto the gearbox the main shaft the primary shaft and stuff is moving in here and when you do hit the wrong gear what does happen the drive shaft hits the primary shaft and look at that do you see how thin this is here so if the primary shaft is hit by the drive shaft of course a lot of force hits onto this very very small weak spot because force always looks for the easiest way and this is where the parts are thin so the trick is with this washer to transfer the forces that are hitting onto the primary shaft into the clutch cover and onto the engine case and to take away this directly transmission into this just thin spot here we're gonna take it out and gonna measure it now mate look at that do you see how thin this is so it was not a problem with just three horsepower five four five horsepower but when the power did grow there was a need to do something and this is why the washer changed and it does not have this weird shape for no reason it does have a reason it shall clamp between the engine case and the clutch cover but look this up how thick is this this is 3.7 millimeter the idea of this washer is clamp between the clutch cover and the engine case this will support transferring the impacting forces into stronger parts of the engine case and the clutch cover has a statically very very good shape the anti-case crack trick is use this washer there is a reason why it has this shape first mount the clutch cover and then afterwards to tighten the screw nut because with tightening the screw nut you will clamp the washer against the case and against the clutch cover and have a look at the clutch cover it is an arch and arch is statically very very good the force which would hit in here at that 3.7 millimeter thin spot is transferred into thicker parts and the arch of the clutch cover which can handle these hits because we do have hits just think of if you put it in the first gear it makes cluck and scooter jumps and if you hit a wrong gear that's way worse the basis is 125 cubic it was never designed for having 30 horsepower 20 horsepower even 18 horsepower because original 125 engines did have what um three four five horsepower that was it so we tripled or five times more power even ten times more but with this engine case trick and the impacting forces transmitted into stronger parts of the engine case you do not have to worry about an engine case crack normal washer and screw nut we have the same at the sprint we have a washer and a screw nut and this safety metal sheet then it did change with px and the power grew we, we do have a weird very thick washer look at that and there's a reason why it is thick and has this weird shape the security washer and also a bigger screw nut use this trick why it was designed like that and you do not have to worry about an engine case crack yes piaggio cases are good for most of the tunings plug and play tuning of course standard tuning which means you just take stuff out of the box and put it together but 2022 20, horsepower nowadays even fine tuning 25 26 horsepower wheel horsepower of course and even more read wealth power is also possible do not worry about an engine case crack use this 
shape. That was it, a bit more in detail. I know I do have already a guide online, but it's a really, really short one. Maybe this helps. Share this info. It is really known all around the world. Share this info. Only few people do know and apply it. Even good shops who demand that they are consulting technically, they do not have it in their guide. So it's a pity and a shame. Guys, share the info. Cheers. Have a good one. Keep it up. Mmm. You like what it's on? Of course. Subscribe. Still a few stories to come up. Cheers. <laughs>